Good afternoon from the CBS 19 Newsroom. I'm Jamie Garrick. And I'm Justin Early. Two 14-year-old boys have been arrested in connection with the shooting death of Jacob Michael Johnson. The 17-year-old was found dead in his car Sunday night in the Upshur County community of Diana. More arrests are possible as the investigation continues. President Obama visited Fort Hood for a memorial service for the victims of the Fort Hood shooting rampage. Obama said that this latest attack, quote, tears at wounds still raw from five years ago. Officials say that Army Specialist Ivan Lopez has took a 45 caliber handgun onto the installation last week and killed three people while injuring 16 more. He then took his own life. Tyler ISD Superintendent Gary Mooring is resigning as of June 30th. Mooring says he's leaving because of continued health concerns, but the district plans to do next tonight. Kilgore police arrested two people accused of stealing oil field pipe. An officer says that he found the two on an oil lease off Fritz Swanson Road Sunday, cutting up numerous oil field pipes. John Philip Elder and Jason Dean, both of Kilgore, face theft charges. The Tyler City Council today approved a construction contract for the Lake Tyler Dam Repair Project. Graycon Construction Incorporated will handle that job. The Lake Tyler Dam was constructed in 1948 and 1949 and has a slow leak, which it's had for some time. All that plus weather and sports tonight on CBS 19 News at 5 and 6. And you can visit CBS19.tv anytime for the latest online.